Now, before we get into how funny Kayla is, y'all know August 9th was King Von's birthday. And of course, O Block celebrated. Rumor has it they are still celebrating right now today. Unfortunately, it was reported that they had a birthday party for King Von, and somebody had the audacity to come up there shooting at everyone. Oh, shit. Man, I think just did all this doing. He did all this shooting this. Every shot. Oh, BD just missed every fucking shot. He just missed. And like a dummy, he went to jail. I'm pretty sure he saw that as an opportunity to get rid of a few people. It probably had nothing to do with him trying to ruin a birthday party specifically. Now, as you all can see, we have the lovely Kayla B and the beautiful Asian doll in the office. Now, like I said, it was King Von birthday and a lot of people celebrated him. For example, Asian got him spray painted on her shirt and literally days later, Kayla tweeted, my brother hated spray painting anything. When anybody used to try to get it for him, he used to be like, man, I don't want that. Now, supporters are a bit confused. They want to know why when Lil Durk spray painted King Von on the back of his jacket, Kayla did not have the same energy. In fact, she liked the photo, shared the photo, and commented underneath the photo. Do y'all think Kayla is picking that Asian, or does she have a point? This message is for Nicki Minaj and Kenneth Petty. Tell your fucking people to leave my family alone okay don't call my fucking family don't call my brothers don't call anybody leave me and my family the fuck alone it is being said that Nicki minaj and her husband kenneth petty are both being sued it has been alleged by the woman he sexually assaulted back in 1994 that Nicki and kenneth are harassing her the lawyer representing the victim said for many years my client did the best she could to move on with her life and away from the horrors of 1994 my client had no contact with or any interest in coming after mr petty or miss minaj they came after her now she fights back now i don't know what Nikki did or what her husband did so it's not much I can see now as for his cousin who went on live to tell the whole world she would beat his victim ass miss ma'am you in some trouble so check this out and big shout out to on site I told y'all Cuban doll said she left Jay because he cheated on her with another man a month later he responds and says bitch all in her feelings because I ain't give her dick in a month now she on Twitter calling me gay she know I drop real good that pussy needs spit so i'd rather her swallow my babies do y'all believe jada youngin or do y'all believe cuban let me know in my comment section below and please like this video so check this out mr meek and tori got into a cute little squabble meek said blessing i got the nelson mandela humanitarian award Thank you. Rest in peace to the great Nelson. I ain't grew up playing ball. I had a Smith and Western because where I'm from, it's very hard to turn 27. Tori tried correcting him and said, Smith and Wesson. Meek responded and said, it's called Meek Flow. Say congrats or something weirdo. Tori says, Meek, it was not that deep. I just ain't want you looking dumb. Congrats, bozo. Meek responds one last time. Tori, it's kind of deep. You trying to help me with my spelling and you know for a fact I don't with you right now if y'all guys really rich why y'all acting like we cool on the internet and you know we not do you and stay out of street business when we talking about them blowers i was later tori tweeted this kid is a goofy now look it ain't been too beautiful for tori this week because not only did he get into it with me but he got into it with cassidy and now he's in trouble with the law. So I told y'all for the Rolling Loud weekend, the baby brought out Tori as a guest. Only thing about this is it has been alleged that Meg was backstage, which means Tori was within 100 yards of Megan, which violates the protective order she has against him. TMZ revealed that prosecutors recently filed a motion to hold the rapper in contempt for violating a court order to stay clear of Meg Thee Stallion. Basically, they're trying to send him back to jail. And for those of you who are confused as to why Tori is not allowed around Meg. It's been alleged that he is the man that shot her in the foot.